it is general reading this may or may not resonate okay if it doesn't check out your other placements if you need a personal reading all that information is going to be below wands here so that's a lot of determined energy okay so much wanting to stand their ground okay with the ace of swords here i feel that you want to speak your truth or you're in this mood of communication okay you want to communicate your truth to this person and with the seven of wands here either you block this person or this person's blocked you out this person on the other side with the tower here this person is going through some spiritual shit okay either this person is going through a spiritual transformation or they're they're going through some huge changes within themselves all right and with the ace of swords here you have clarity about the situation or you're just wanting to cut through the bullshit because with the seven of wands here this is a very determined energy very stubborn energy someone who feels the need to stand their ground or protect themselves from the other person You're being very patient, cool, calm, and collected in your emotions, but your logic says that you need to cut your bullshit. Okay, logically, they're going through like a huge epiphany. Okay, and with the Queen of Pentacles here, I think this person now realizes that they want something solid and committed with you because they're wanting to rush and duck their attitude. But I think you're done with them because with the world here, as your attitude, it's like you're done. You're done. You're you're ending the cycle. You've completed a cycle successfully with this person. and you're closing a chapter you're shutting old cycles okay when the nine of pentacles and reverse as a neutral energy i think this is one of you i think this is this person who's being very very codependent on you okay this is someone who's either codependent financially or you know emotionally whatever right but this is someone who just does not want to be alone someone who does not want to be on their own we'll see why is the seven of wands here Is the seven of wands here? The tower in reverse. Someone's very, very determined on not letting a situation end, or someone's very determined on resisting an ending to something that it is very evident that it is going to fall. Someone does not want a tower to crash. Someone does not want a relationship to be over, and they're hell bent on not letting it end, or they're hell bent on. Uh, resisting an ending, okay? It's an inevitable ending, guys. But the more you resist it, the more painful it's going to be, okay? It can also mean that there has been a tower moment between you guys, and now this person is very, very determined on, you know, damaging uh, and repairing the damages, okay? They want to repair the damages and they want to rebuild from scratch, okay? Take it how it resonates. Why is the Ace of Swords here? Okay, I'll take it. Ace of Pentacles in reverse with the Hangman in reverse. I think you are very, very determined on not seeing things, not seeing things from the other person's point of view, and I think you're very determined on cutting this person out. Because with the Ace of Pentacles in reverse here, I feel you are doubting if you can make this happen with this person. Okay? Because with the Hangman in reverse here, I feel you're just being very stubborn. You have a very one-sided perspective. Again. This could be a stalemate. Okay, it's like I think you like dug your heels into the sand, and you're just not ready to budge. You're being very stubborn. What is the star wall? Eight of cups in reverse. Give me one more card. Why is the eight of cups in reverse? Why is the eight of cups in reverse? Eight of Pentacles. This person out here, they've gone through like a huge change within themselves, or this is like an aha moment that they have. And now with the Eight of Cups in reverse and the Eight of Pentacles, this person wants to put in the effort to work into this situation, into the connection. Okay, which they probably didn't before. They now want to work on this connection. All right. They can't walk away. This person can't walk away from you. They're very invested. This person is returning back to you, okay? Because this person could have walked away and like, oh, I'm good on my own. I'm okay on my own. The grass is green on all the other side, whatever. They're coming back because they've had this sudden, unexpected change, and now they want to work on this situation with you. And you, on the other hand, you're like, fuck no, I'm not changing my mind. You're not changing your mind. And with the Ace of Pentacles, and you want to say this is going to be a missed opportunity and for you. I think with the Ace of Swords here. You're very clear in your mind. You know, it's like it is what it is, and I'm okay with that. I think so. All right. Why is the temperance here? 
I think you're doing everything that you can to stay away from this person because this person could be bringing a lot of drama in your life, okay? Or this person just throws you off guard, okay? Things just go off balance when you're with this person. Why is the temperance here? Five for the sun. Five for the sun. realize um cancer that this person your relationship with the sun here i think you just want to be happy i think you just want to be happy with the temperance and the sun here you're okay on your own you just want to be happy this person could have again brought in a lot of chaos and drama within your life is what i'm getting you're just not happy with this person okay and you've cut this person out and you're very you're not budging you're not budging you could have released also this person or released a situation where this person kept you on hold or kept you in a limbo for a very long time, okay? And you don't see something getting off ground with this person. In your emotions, you just want to be happy. You want to maintain your peace, peace. You want to maintain that balance within yourself, okay? Because with the Ten of Pentacles in reverse here, you feel this is a situation that's just not reaching that point of stability and commitment. There's just a lack of stability and growth within this relationship, okay? Maybe you want something stable with this person, or with the Ten of Pentacles reverse, it could also mean that this is a long-term commitment or a marriage and you're wanting to get out of this marriage, okay? And your happiness is going to be to get rid of this marriage. Why is the Queen of Pentacles here? You decide you could be dealing with a mother, you could this could be a wife, but this is someone, you know, Nine of Cups with the Page of Swords. This person is keeping tabs on you if you're in temptation with this person. This person is trying to find out more information. They're trying to find out ways of how they can come towards you. And with the Nine of Cups here, you are their wish fulfillment. I don't think this person's gonna let you go. You ain't going nowhere. <laughs> I don't think this person's letting you go, seriously. I mean, look at them, they're fine stalking. They're trying to get more information on you. The Page of Swords is the FBI of the tarot. With the Nine of Cups here, you make them very, very, very happy. Okay, and with the Queen of Pentacles here, this person wants to invest into you. They want to be with you. They want something stable, committed, or whatever, right? Probably this person now wants to give you everything that you always wanted. But I think you, on the other hand, you're like out. Because your happiness does not lie with this person. Clap for the Nine of Pentacles in reverse. It's like the moment you walk away, now this person wants everything. Although they could have very well been the one who walked away, right? But I think you realize that you could have cut them out and whatever. But they definitely are returning back. They want to work on this. You make them very, very happy, Cancer. And they want the stability with you. If you haven't divorced this person, this person wants to revive the marriage. They want to give this another chance. You're their happiness, you're their wish fulfillment, okay? And the page of souls, this person's trying to find ways and chances to approach you. But they're definitely keeping tabs on you, for sure. Their logic asks them to work on this, okay? And in their emotions, you, on both ways, you're very clear about what you want. Again, I'm just hearing it again and again. So, I just want to be happy. That's just what you want to be cancelled. Why is the Nine of Pentacles in reverse? Why is the Nine of Pentacles in reverse? person wants a relationship with you. They're feeling very codependent on you. You could be dealing with someone, you know, who's very dependent on you financially, but now this person wants to take care of you, okay? They want to give you that nurturing, you know, they want to be very practical. This is someone very grounded, okay? But yeah, their focus is you. Their focus is making you happy, having something stable with you. This person is very codependent on you. They love you with the two of cups. They want a relationship with you. Or they want to get back to you. Take it up resumes. I think this looks like a reconciliation to me. They want a reconciliation. They miss you. They can't do without you. Okay? This is someone who can't be on their own. They really, really need you. You on the other hand with the world here. Why is the world here? See, Ten of Wands. This is a relationship that is a big burden on you. Why is the Ten of Wands here? Knight of Cups. I think you. Let's see this side first. Why is the Knight of Wands here? Try for the Knight of Wands. 
they're not sold in reverse? Why are they not sold in reverse? This person, let's talk about this person, okay? This person is hell-bent on coming towards you, for sure. Like the ones that are very passionate about you. They want to rush you now. But the Ten of Swords in reverse, where this person is wanting to revive this entire connection, okay? This is someone who's hell-bent on resisting and ending to something. The Tower here, uh, the Tower in reverse here, Seven of Wands, determined energy not to avoid a disaster from happening. See, Ten of Swords in reverse, that's what I said, right? This person wants to bring back the relationship from the brink of failure. This person wants to rebuild with you, okay? But they're not going to let it end. They're not going to let it end. But again, page of Pentacles in reverse, they're procrastinating or they're just purposely putting things on hold. Okay, I don't know what they're contemplating on. Again, page of Swords, maybe they're trying to find out more information before they come up towards you, okay? Because they just don't want to, they, they want to do their research before they come towards you. But yeah, this person wants it, wants it, and wants it with you. They're not going to let you go. I don't think they're letting you go, for sure. You, on the other hand, World Ten of Wands and the Knight of Cups here. I think you're going to do what follows your heart. And your heart is asking you to leave this relationship, is what I'm getting, okay? Because this is a relationship that's becoming a very big burden on you, okay? It's stressing you out, it's overwhelming you. You're not being able to take that stress and anxiety, okay? It's a very draining energy, the Ten of Wands here. And I think with the world, you want to shut the cycle and the Knight of Cups, so you want to follow your heart, you want to do what makes you happy. And I think you're already illuminated to that fact here in your emotions with the sun here and the ten of pentacles in reverse here. You probably want to end this long-term commitment or marriage. It's just not making you happy. But this person out here, you've been illuminated to a fact that you need to get rid of this relationship. They have this realization of the fact that they need to want to return back to you and they want to work on this. Like the outcome, we have the two of pentacles in reverse and the lovers in reverse. So I feel that there is going to be Someone's going to be very, very decisive, okay? If you're juggling or they're juggling, someone who's here in two minds, right? I think it should be you. With the two of pentacles here, I think you've made up your mind with the two of pentacles in reverse here and the lovers here in reverse, there is a disconnection between you guys. What is the two of pentacles in reverse? What is the two of pentacles in reverse? Three of wands in reverse. This wanted to come on again. You know more waiting. You're no more waiting for the fruition or no more waiting for the ships to come in, right? You're giving up, you're turning your back towards the situation, okay? Because with the lovers in reverse here, you're no more juggling, okay? You're giving up on the situation because you anyways feel very disconnected. The lovers in reverse does not always mean a disconnection, but it also means an end of a law of a soulmate contract. And that's what I'm getting here with the world. The lovers in reverse, three of wands in reverse here. I don't think you want to wait for this person anymore and I don't think you're even manifesting this person anymore. You're wanting to move forward. Knight of Cups, you're wanting to lay down this burden and you just want to move forward. But this person, I don't quite think they're going to let you go. They're going to do everything in their power to keep you, to stop you from moving forward. They want this with you. They want this with you. They, they don't want to be on their own. They see you as their wish fulfillment, okay? They see you as their happiness. They're rushing in, guys, regardless. They're rushing in. You may be closing the chapter, but they're rushing in. May take some time because they're in the reverse right now with the page of pentacles in reverse procrastination, but very soon they're going to rush in, okay? They're not going to let this end. They're not going to let you go so easily. So that's all I have for you, Cancer. I hope this reading resonates with you. Leave your comments below. Like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.